Okay, what are they looking at? What funny thing for them to be looking at? Horse's skull. Do we know that ghost? Harvak! You saved him! His soul is free, I can feel it! He's okay. such a loyal beast. Here, I'll teach you how to call him to you. He'll help you get around this wretched place. But I'm sure he'd be much happier someplace sunnier. Goodbye, hero. Take good care of Arvac for me. Such a good horse. Okay. Oh, Serana, that was a bit rude. Let's kill those keeper things and get back to the prison. Okay, okay, yeah, I see. I, yeah, I, I get it. You, the priorities, not horses. Can you see a keeper thing anywhere? Um, we must see people up here. Ooh. Oh. Oh, um. Oh, this. Oh, I'm up here now. Do you think killing the do you think killing the keeper will save them? I agree with you. We had to jump on one of those to get up here. Maybe we have to jump on this to go down. What do you think? Yes. Okay, that's one down. That over there. You look after that sword, but I feel a lot better if you've got something more than a dagger to protect you. There's, I think I can see a building over there through the mist.
I can I can see through that window. People being drained. There he is. should be gone. I wish we could do something about the other souls here. Yes, the barrier's gone. You managed to destroy all three keepers? Yeah. Very impressive. Thank you. Um, can you give us a scroll now, then? Yes. Please, follow me. Okay. Keep watch for Dernavir. With the prison's oh, yes. barrier down, he's almost certain to investigate. Okay. Um... We need to be ready then. Give my astonishment, but I never thought I'd witness the death of that dragon. Well, I'm the Dragonborn. Besides, what makes you say that? Volumes written on Dernavir allege that he can't be slain by normal means. It appears they were mistaken. Well, no. Unless... Unless what? The soul of a dragon is as resilient as its owner's scaly hide. It's yeah, possible tough. that your killing blow has merely displaced Donavir's physical form while he reconstitutes himself. Uh, that doesn't sound good. How long's that going to take then? Minutes, hours, years. I can't even begin to guess. I suggest we don't wait around to find out. Well, no. now let's get you the Elder Scroll, and you can be on your way. Okay. Oh, thank you. That's it. That's the last scroll. Come on, let's take it to Dexia. Now that you've retrieved the Elder Scroll, you should be on your way. If there's anything I can do before you depart, you must let me know. Well, yeah, actually. Can you help me get my soul back? Because Saran has been a bit, well, not very forthcoming on that particular subject. 
So my daughter applied some of the lessons I taught her about necromancy, did she? Yeah, looks Don't like worry. it. I think I can help you. Thank you. Um, how? Your soul essence was trapped inside a gem. That's right. When you and Serana entered the soul cairn, it was given to the ideal masters as payment. Okay. You simply need to retrieve the gem. The moment you touch it, your soul essence will be restored. Okay, um, where is it? There's an offering altar not terribly far from here. I'm willing to bet that the gem you're looking for is there. Okay. Is there anything else? Would be your last chance. You're staying here? I have no choice. As I told you before, I'm a daughter of Cold Harbor. If I return Bamba. to Tamriel, that increases Harkon's likelihood of bringing the tyranny of the sun to fruition. Okay. I mean, we, we could use your help. As much as it pains me to send you and Serana back alone, I can't take the risk. Remember that Harkon is not to be trusted. No oh, I matter know what he promises, he'll deceive you in order to get what he wants. And promise me you'll keep my daughter safe. She's the only thing of value I have left. Well, I'll do my best. I mean, I've given her a decent weapon. She only had a dagger. Right, offering table. spoken to me before. I thought you were dead. Cursed, not dead. Doomed to exist in this form for eternity. Trapped between us and the knock. Between life and death. Okay. Why are we speaking? Because you tried to kill me a little while ago. I believe in civility among seasoned warriors. And I find your ear worthy of my words. My claws have rendered the flesh of innumerable foes, but I have never once been felled on the field of battle. Oh. I therefore honor name you Quanarin, or Vanquisher in your tongue. Oh, thank you. Um, I, I, I found you equally worthy? desire to speak with you was born from the result of our battle, Gwenarin. I merely wish to respectfully ask a favor of you. A favor? You think I can do a favor for a dragon? What kind of favor? For countless years I've roamed the Soul Cairn in unintended service to the Ideal Masters. Oh. Before this, I roamed the skies above Tamriel. I desire to return there. Okay. Why don't you just fly? What's stopping you? I fear that my time here has taken its toll upon me. I share a bond with this dreaded place. Oh. If I ventured far from the Soul Cairn, my strength would begin to wane until I was no more. Oh. I wish I could help. Is there, is there some sort of way I can help? I will place my name with you and grant you the right to call my name from Tamriel. Okay. Do me this simple honor and I will fight at your side as your Grazi Mazen, your ally. And teach you my food. Alright. Just call your name when I'm back in Tamriel. Trivial in your mind, perhaps. For me, it would mean a great deal. Okay. I don't require an answer, Quinarin. Simply speak my name to the heavens when you feel the time is 
is right. Okay. How on earth did you end up here in the Soul Can to begin with? There was a time when I called Tamriel my home. Yes, you said. But those days have long since passed. Mm-hmm. The Nova roamed the skies, vying for their small slices of territory that resulted in immense and ultimately fatal battles. Mm, yeah, that's a long time ago. Very long time. Were you part of all that, like Parthenax? I was. But unlike some of my brethren, I sought solutions outside the norm in order to maintain my superiority. I began to explore what the Dova call Elok Gilan, the ancient forbidden art that you call necromancy. Oh. Okay. Like, so, 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 like, Serana's mother there, you sought out the soul can for answers, because that's where all the souls go, yeah? The ideal masters assured me that my powers would be unmatched, that I could raise legions of the undead. Okay. In return, I was to serve them as a keeper until the death of the one who calls herself Valerica. Right, she's a vampire. And they didn't tell you that she's actually immortal. I discovered too late that the Ideal Masters favor deception over honor and had no intention of releasing me from my binding. Okay. They had control of my mind, but fortunately they couldn't possess my soul. No, I, uh, only I can do that. So is, is that why you're free now? Free? No. I have been here too long, Panarin. The soul cairn has become a part of what I am. I can never fully call Tamriel my home again, or I would surely perish. I only hope that you will allow me the precious moments of time there through your call. Yeah. I think you've been punished enough. It was... It's in the nature of dragons to want power. I mean... It probably wasn't the right thing for you to do. And, and some might think that it was just that you were tricked by the Ideal Masters. But um, I... I, I, I do know that dragons can change. Parthenax taught me that. And I think you've been punished enough. I'll, I'll call you from Tamriel when I get a chance. Maybe I can rescue another sort of soul. I need to find... The sooner we get the scroll home, the sooner we deal with my father. Yeah, well, first things first, Serana. I, I want my soul back. Right, there it is. I'm... I want my soul back. Oh, whoa. 